Hello, Marguerite here. I have some updates about how my tiny house is coming along. I am turning it into a studio, a little art studio, and I want to show you a little bit how that's coming. And I also have an announcement about a new membership that I'm going to be offering. I'm going to give you all the details about what's in it and why it could be interesting for you. So pretty much the only new thing around here are the lace curtains, which are now hung. And I love these curtains. I love them because the light hits them and it changes throughout the day. They remind me of my grandmother who used to have lace curtains in her house. So that's kind of a nice connection. Now directly on the other side, there is this gap. And here I want to put a tall hutch. It's not very deep, which is good. Um, so it'll be perfect for this spot. The thing was that it is a gray color. So I am in the process right now of painting it into kind of a sage green, a nice green color. I've been thinking about ways that I can use the bathroom as storage. I am not planning to hook it up um, with water and sewer. So it's just a space that I can use to put things away. And I have my rig for recording. It's quite big, but it is on wheels. And so I can move it and put it into that space when I'm not using it. Lastly, after much debate, I have come up with a solution for displaying my rubber stamps. I'm going to put up a series of shelves right here. And if you'll notice, this is really shallow. There's not a whole lot of space there, which has been the challenge. So some shelves that are custom made are going to have to fit exactly with this depth in mind. I'll have about eight of them so that I can put as many uh, rubber stamps that I need to have there. So that's pretty much everything. The next time I show you what this place looks like, everything's gonna be done. So that's gonna be super exciting. Now, the other thing that I want to share with you is about this new membership that I am offering. So instead of me just talking to the camera, I'm going to do some collage work on my desk and I will be showing you that while I give you the details of the membership so I'm working on a project in my grid journal today. I sped up the whole video because I was tearing a bunch of tiny little pieces and gluing them in and it just moves things along if I show it to you in a faster speed. I'm going to talk about my membership and everything that's in it. And if I do want to show you some visuals, I will pause what I'm working on here and then come right back. So let me tell you about this membership. It's called the Vintage and Collage Club and the goal is to have themes and projects that we work on together every single month so that we can enjoy working with vintage as a major component in collage to strengthen our collage skills, and then also to have fun making art. One of the major components of the membership is the digital magazine that you get at the beginning of the month. And here I will pause my grid journal work so that you can see a few pages in the magazine. So every month we'll have a new theme and a new project to work on. The magazine provides that information and then also delves a little bit deeper into our project, providing examples and other support material. There's also printables. There's the take three challenge that a lot of people liked to do in the past. And there's also an interview with a member who works in this collage medium. One of the biggest things about this membership and something that lots of people have been asking for is more opportunities to exchange art 
every single month there is an art exchange if you are interested in exchanging art. I know not everybody is. So I will no longer be the middle person, the, the person who receives the mail, exchanges and sends out. You will be exchanging directly with a partner that you sign up to get. So if you are interested in exchanging art, you can read about the process in the magazine of how that will work. Something else that's in the membership is a monthly co-working. So at the beginning of the month, a new project is announced and then we'll have a scheduled meet probably around the 8th of the month to talk about the project and work on it together. Now, what kinds of projects are they going to be? Projects are postcard art. It will be ATCs. It will be zines. It will be ink box cards. All these different types of projects we will do so that each month we have something new to work on. Sign up and the main place of communication is inside of the Collage Art Collective, which is my online art community. There's a special space inside the collective where I'll be posting information or there's place to add your photos or just be part of the conversation. This membership is super exciting for me because I love to encourage people to collage, particularly with vintage papers, but collage in general. And I love that we're going to have projects that we work on all at the same time and that you have that opportunity to exchange if you want to. I do think it's important that people have the opportunity to get other people's art. It's really great to make things for yourself, of course, and I have you know a collection of my own things, but there really is something to having this goal of exchanging your art, right? It's really special to have someone else's interpretation of that project. So there's that. And then also for me, I get to work on this magazine, which is so much fun for me. Many of you know that I create books, workbooks, I self-publish, and this magazine is part of self-publishing, so I really do enjoy putting these together. So if you would like to see the magazine for yourself, the link is in the description box for you to download. I think that's everything I want to say about the membership. I hope you'll consider it. And here's the rest of the grid journal spread. So I'm going to be hosting a YouTube live on October the 11th at 9 a.m. Pacific time. I'm going to be doing a postcard project on our monthly theme. So come and hang out and you can work on yours along with me if you would like. And then it's also an opportunity for you to ask any questions about the membership and learn a little bit more about it if you are interested in it. So I'll create the link for the YouTube live. I hope to see you there and thanks so much for watching.